So I'm getting ready for tomorrow. I'll be going up to Vermont early Saturday morning. Got some furniture going to throw in the back of the truck. I got some insulation. I got all my tool bags and tool boxes. Um, I did buy some uh, ceiling insulation. I'm going to give that a try. And what I usually do once a week, twice uh, every two weeks, I go through all my bags and I try to clean up all the tools. It's a mess. I have, a, I have like one bag dedicated to my electrical, one bag for plumbing, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, I was digging through and I usually make all my holes when I was doing the, um, the sink in the shower I usually just start the hole like this if I don't have one big enough um, and then I'll go ahead and use the sawzall or something but uh, I, I have a set of these Milwaukee hole dozers and once I use it once I can never get the damn thing apart and I don't use them that often I always forget I had this another a different uh, cobalt I think I got it in there um, let me see Yep, so I have a cobalt set too, and I even have old school ones, I don't know where that is. So, this um, this one here comes in this nice little case, and so it's easy to pack in my stuff and take with me. But once you use one of them, you can never take it off to use the other. I always forget how. I took out that, uh, the little Allen screw, and that just removes the guide drill. So, now if I'm right, you put throw on a what is this three quarter three quarter on an impact gun put it in reverse of course you got to have all this stuff with you on the job site pop it on if you got man hands you could try to hold on to it watch the blades up and that's how you get it off okay let me tell you something before I went ahead and assembled all that I usually just throw it on my vice grip or my uh, my my vice right here, my bench vice, and I grab one of these um, wrenches and I just crank on it. I could not get that off using this this time. These things, they got to come up with a better way. I, I don't know, pain in the ass. But for all you that are at, out there ripping up your hands or trying to crank on it, get that impact uh, socket or put a socket on that impact drill and take it right off what a pain in the ass that's the end of this episode folks thanks for watching just a quick tip nothing more go ahead hit that subscribe button and if i helped you out go ahead and give me a thumbs up thanks for watching